Honey, no one is stupid enough to call a shoe hotline. <laughs> oh, yeah? Well, everyone in high school said no one was stupid enough to marry the big redhead. <laughs> but someone was, wasn't he? Oh, look, Denny's commercial's coming on. Hi, I'm Dr. Shoe. Man on the side of your feet. I'm a goner. <laughs> Excuse me, I'm getting a call. <laughs> Dr. Shoe, hello. Oh, Dr. Shoe. I don't know what to do. I'm going to a party in five minutes, and my shoes are too tight for both of my feet. Ouch. Can you help me? Has this happened to you? I'm willing to bet that it has. As a matter of fact, I'm betting 50,000 bucks that it has. So, if you're like Muffy here... <laughs> Even if you're just fat and ugly and have a shoe problem, call me on the shoe line. That's 555-SHOE. Can I help? Shoe betcha. I feel better already. <laughs> and don't forget, say hi to a shoe. I see you're all looking at me a little bit differently now. <laughs> Okay, everybody, may on your positions by the phone. Research shows 98% of the calls happen in the first three minutes. Let's go, let's go. <laughs> Honey, let's just say that for one minute, this shoe line doesn't work out. <laughs> Big negative, mind you. It's uh, it's just that no one has called today, and no one will call for a million years. <laughs> so, uh, honey, just out of curiosity, what did you use for collateral? The only thing we have. Our plunger with a hundred thousand miles on it. <laughs> yeah, that's right, Peg. Keep on stroking me. <laughs> no, and this is where I made my most brilliant move. All I had to do was sign over the house. Good, honey. I was getting sick of living indoors. <laughs> okay, kids. Come on, it's almost midnight. Time for bed. Come on. Uh, did Dad get any calls? Yeah, Mom called him an idiot. <laughs> Steve, you haven't given up on me, have you? <laughs> Dr. Shoe? It's the doorbell, Al. Well, get it, Peg. I'm on the phone. Dr. Shoe? <laughs> the government should be paying us. I mean, if he's not disabled, who is? <laughs> well, Steve, you told me not to yell at you about the loan until midnight. Then I'd see. What am I seeing? Hello? 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 Well, Steve? <laughs> he hasn't spoken for hours, Marcy. Don't you pull that coma stuff with me, Steven. <laughs> $1,000 an IQ point. <laughs> and I can't blame Al. A man gives a gun to a chimp and the chimp shoots someone. You don't blame the chimp. Hey! That was a hidden dig at me, wasn't it? <laughs> Well, let me tell you something. The opera ain't over till the last heterosexual falls asleep. 